his parents were away, a teenage boy and his friends drank some of his parents' gin. After they had finished drinking, the teenage boy went into the kitchen and poured water into the gin bottle to return it to the level where it had originally been. They then put the bottle back exactly where they had found it. However, when the boy's parents returned, they immediately knew that the boy had drank their gin by looking at it. The boy was punished for his illicit drinking. How did the parents know? Answer. The parents kept their bottle of gin in the freezer. Since gin has a very low freezing point, it can remain as a liquid, even to very low temperatures. Because the boy added water to the gin to try and hide the fact that he and his friends had drank most of it, a solid block of ice had formed inside the bottle. This allowed the boy's parents to know that their gin had been tampered with, since they were looking at a bottle which had solid ice formed inside, instead of just being liquid. After spilling some tomato ketchup down his shirt, a man decided to put his shirt in the washing machine, in an attempt to remove the stain. As he was pouring bleach into the washing machine, he spilled some on the floor. He got some cleaning fluid and started mopping up the spilt bleach. Minutes later, the man was dead. How did the man die? Answer. If you know your science, mixing bleach and ammonia, which is found in most cleaning products, creates chlorine gas. This gas is deadly when breathed in and can kill, which is what happened to the poor man who started mopping up the spilt bleach with cleaning fluid. driving his car when he notices that the car in front of him is leaking a lot of water onto the road from the exhaust pipe. Worried with what might happen, the man signals the driver in front of him to pull over. The man approaches the driver and warns him that his car is leaking. However, the driver just simply looks at him with a grin and explains. What is the driver's reason for his car leaking water? Answer. The driver's response is that he drives a hydrogen cell car. This type of car uses hydrogen to power it and exhausts water as a product. A world famous chemist was found murdered in his laboratory. The police have narrowed it down to five suspects. What they do know is that it was a two-man job. The suspects' names are Felice, Thomas, Anthony, Nicholas, and Scott. A note was also found with the body. The note read 26, 3, 58, slash, 
28, 27, 57, 16. Who are the murderers? Answer Felice and Nicholas are the murderers. If you look at the note very carefully, you will notice that the numbers written correspond to atomic numbers on the periodic table of elements. Fe, iron, Li, lithium, Ce, cerium, which spells out Felice, and Ni, nickel, Co, Cobalt, LA Lanthanum, S Sulfur, which spells out Nicholas. This last riddle is extremely challenging, so if you get this one, then you are a genius. No doubt about it. I know you guys like a challenge, so here you go. Where does Earth belong in the following astronomical series? Mercury, Jupiter, Mars, Saturn, Neptune, Uranus, Venus. Answer. This series lists the planets in order of increasing axis inclination. Earth has an axis inclination of 23.4 degrees, since that is less than Mars's axis inclination, but more than Jupiter's axis inclination, Earth would therefore be placed in between Jupiter and Mars. By the way, if you guys didn't already know, we opened up an Instagram account about two months ago where we post fun daily facts. We would really appreciate it if you all could go and give the page a follow. And one last thing, we recently hit 150,000 subscribers on YouTube. We genuinely cannot thank each and every one of you enough. We are so grateful for all of the support we've been getting, whether it be from comments, which we love reading and replying to, or the likes on our videos. We always prioritize quality over quantity, so when we see people commenting about how good the editing on the video is, it really puts us in a good mood. So we thank you for this. We hope you all continue to stick around because we have not lost our passion. This is our passion. We are living our dream, and that's all thanks to you guys. We will never forget that. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please show your support by leaving a like and sharing this video as it really does help us a lot. Don't forget to comment below too and we will pin up the best comment. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a video from us. Lastly, for daily facts and more, follow all of our social media accounts, which are on screen and in the description. Thanks and until the next video.